Well, in December last year, the uh, Maharashtra High Court acquitted actor Salman Khan for his role in the 2002 hit and run case, but his legal troubles are not over. The Supreme Court has started hearing that case because Maharashtra has appealed against his acquittal. In fact, uh, the lawyer, the Attorney General who appeared on, the, on, on behalf of Maharashtra actually calling it a travesty of justice. Bollywood actor Salman Khan facing a strong legal battle in India's top court. Less than two months after being acquitted by the Bombay High Court in the 2002 hit-and-run case, the Maharashtra government, today opposing his acquittal, told the Supreme Court that his acquittal was a travesty of justice. Attorney General Mukul Rodhgi, appearing for Maharashtra, described the High Court order acquitting Salman Khan as perverse and told the court Salman Khan had consumed alcohol on the night of the accident and was driving the SUV which crashed into a pavement, killing one person and injuring four others. A trial court in Mumbai had convicted Salman Khan in the hit-and-run case in May last year, sentencing him to five years in jail. But his conviction was overturned by the Bombay High Court in December, which concluded that the prosecution had failed to prove its case against Khan. While the trial court said that it found Salman Khan guilty of being drunk and driving the SUV which killed one person, the High Court said that the prosecution failed to prove its case against Salman Khan. The trial court said that all charges against Khan had been proved and sentenced him to five years in jail. The High Court said that the evidence including bar receipts and Salman Khan's blood were not properly handled and acquitted him. The Maharaj government has called the Bombay High Court order perverse, not good in law, citing the various loopholes because the Ma Ma Bombay High Court did not go into the legal merits of the case. The Attorney General also reminded the court of the Sanjeev Nanda and Pereira hit and run case, saying that there was an alarming rise in such incidents across the country, with top Supreme Court lawyer and former law minister Kapil Sibyl now set to argue in Salman Khan's defence next week. This promises to be a fiercely contested battle in the country's top court. In New Delhi, Siddharth Pandey for TV.